Hello guys, my name is Omkar, and today I'm going to show you how to build this Lego Technic pullback car. So this is a very simple Lego Technic pullback car. It doesn't have a chat body or anything, just like a frame. You could like add a some, you could add like a body on, but I made it a little bit like a dragster style. If I if I could have made it thinner, which I tried, but it wasn't. It, it wasn't as um. Uh, accurate as this one is so I'm gonna show you guys how it works I pull it back and then I let go oh that one didn't come up all the way hmm yeah sometimes this happens you gotta like stretch the rubber band my rubber band's already a little stretched so let's do this it should work now and, and it comes back which is really cool. You pull it back far enough, it can come back. So like it'll go forward a little bit, and then I'll come back. Which I think is pretty really cool. And the reason it comes back is because the rubber band turns the other way after it moves forward, so that it it has like a need to come back, and you can also. You can also need to go backwards. If you like pull it forward, then it'll go backward. Go backward or forward. It's really cool. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to build it. It's very simple. So I'm gonna show you the pieces. Here the piece. Okay, I got. Uh, I dropped the piece over there. I need to use my remover on some pieces. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start with two of these. They are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen long each. They're each thirteen long. You need two. You're gonna put them down, and then you're gonna connect them. You're gonna take to connect them. You're gonna first take this. Use three long, put two these black a seat a seat in these black things, all these black pieces, and put it on right here. Like that. Looks like you're gonna skip two, and then you're gonna put it on. I mean, if you're I mean, skip one. My mistake. I skipped two on accident. I need to put skip one. Yeah, skip two, put these black pieces on, and then you want to put this on like this. Do the same thing on both sides. I mean, on, on, wait, do that on one side. On the other side, put it like this, because you're going to need to put something else. On the uh, on the other side, so let's put it like this, and then put it like this. So you have it like this. Then you're gonna take these pieces and put them on with this side, the bottom, or the other side, the top. Then you're gonna take this piece and put that on like this. I'm gonna connect on just like this. The other side will connect on the top, so that's how it works. Then we're gonna take a blue 
axle uh, blue piece like this. I'm gonna take these pieces and put them on this much. Then I'm gonna put that on here, like on this hole or in this one. And then we're gonna take we're gonna take this yellow axle. We're gonna put one wheel on it. Oh yeah, yeah, one wheel on it. You could either choose that or this other gray axle I have. I could use that. I already used the yellow this time. So put it, skip two, skip one, and then put it. So you have one outside. Then inside you want to put this piece on first. Then you want to put on this piece second and push it in and then but before it goes to the other side you want to put this other yellow one on another yellow piece and then push it out the other side and then push the whole thing like this and then you want to take these and slide them down to the side and then this should be in the middle so it should be look like that or something like this and then on the other side you want to take your other wheel and put that on and make sure you want to keep it's even with the other side or it won't work too good So like this, make sure your wheels are not too tight so they can spin easily still. That might be a little too tight. Yep, that's what we want. And now we're going to take an, another axle, take these small train wheels, put that on, put, this, put it on one side, make it go through the whole thing, put one on the other side. So it's like this. And you want to put this in front of this. Like that. Got your train wheels on there. So it looks like a dragster. Since dragsters have really small wheels in the front. And now, for our last step, take a rubber band. We're going to take our rubber band and put this on like that. Then we're going to stretch this all the way out to this part. And we're gonna put this on here. I'm gonna put it on this orange piece like this. Sorry if you guys can't see that too well. I'm gonna actually try to show it to you guys again. So put it on here. Then we're gonna take the rubber band, put it on here, put it on this piece. And then to make sure it doesn't fall out, take this piece and this piece. Put these uh, black piece on here like this. Then take the orange piece, put that on. So now the rubber band won't fall off, and you can. And now you have a pullback car. Pull back. No, oh. and it goes forward. Back. Well, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed building this car and smash the like button. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.